Benzer carried a torch for you for a long time. Why didn't he tell me? Because in his boneheaded way, I think he thought he was protecting you. He figured if he was honest about his feelings, then Esme would make you suffer even more. And knowing Esme, shudder to think what she might have done. And he told you all of this? In a rare moment of openness. Maybe I've been wrong about him. Look, Spencer is a spoiled, entitled young man. And I am in no way vouching for him. But he does seem to genuinely care for you. That's what was in the letter. Probably. He's reporting to Pinnonville today. That's where Nicholas is, at the PCPD, saying goodbye to Spencer. He wanted me to tell you that, by the way. Oh, thank you. Great. Do you think I should go see Spencer? I think you're the only one who can decide that. But Trina, if you do see Spencer, first, I think you need to think long and hard about what you want. About what you need. I can't believe Spencer really has feelings for me. Oh, sweetheart. Of course he does. Anybody with half brain and working eyes would feel the same. Sweetheart. Thoughts, feelings, words. It's one thing. Action, that's another thing. Whoever you choose needs to be worthy of you and act in your best interest. Thank you. Will you be okay? Oh, yeah, I'm fine. Just make sure you tell me how this all works out. Okay? Okay. <laughs> <laughs>